get left behind two big bags of rubbish. Much more than would normally be expected. Mrs. Evan looked through it, checking if they had not mistakenly thrown out any valuables. There were pictures of guns ripped out of specialist magazines. She discovered snapshots of people in a type of black military-style uniforms that Rio had come to favor. Also being discarded were dresses, jewelry, and a bottle of whiskey. It was most odd. But what brought up the hairs on the back of her neck was a scribbled note. It read, Check the guns. Get rid of the car. Clean the house. Die hair.
Ridgely Turtle in um, Kanto, Ohio. You found up about Robert Smithson's buried woodshed. Um, I'd love to talk to you about it, but unfortunately, I'm off to Europe today, and I won't be back until about the 3rd of October. Um, if that's not too late, and you give me a call then, I'd be happy to reminisce and answer whatever questions you have about installing the woodshed. Thank you. Bye-bye. house and got ill with the flu and was in bed for a couple of days uh, and he wanted to do a mud slide and it was January mud doesn't slide in January at least not in Ohio um, so he he sort of said all right so he'd go back to New York and um, everybody sat around one evening and said well we don't want you to go back to New York. Isn't the something you've always wanted to do? Um, and he said, well, he'd always wanted to bury a house uh, or a building. I guess also related to uh, the U.S. pulling out of Vietnam, so that was around 75. Well. It depends on where you are in the country and how, how closely the place was touched by the riots and the, and the protests. Here, they didn't want to talk about it until, well really last year. Until last year? Last year was the first time that people talked about it, the shootings, openly. Really? Really. So 1995. That's when they, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, 25, 25th anniversary, they got a whole bunch of people to talk who had been here to stand up and do a public, I was there, uh, not a confessional, but a, a testimony. Uh, and a lot of people said it had been the first time that they had talked about it since then. Really? It really wow. affected people deeply here, and they did not want to talk about it. I had a lot of trouble getting photographs. You were born in 1970. Uh-huh. So... <laughs> <laughs> I'm lacking sufficient history skills, probably, of the, that time. I, I don't really have a clear-cut idea of what happened first, second, third, and the whole student you know, Vietnam protest, flower child, I was like 16, 17, and um, went into this uh, history, like AP history, and um, sat down. I think I was sitting in the first or second row because um, before the bell rang, all the students were like doing this, like, oh, peace, like, because that's like only, probably the only they know about that kind of idea is that this is what you do with it. Yeah, like that's all they know. It fits the times because they've been buried as well. When people talk about the 70s now, they have this image of bell-bottom pants, hippies, you know, the wild psychedelic colors, etc., etc. The political thrust of those times is being buried, uh, is being buried even to this day. Um, you have the Brady Bunch movie out now, and, you know, everything is like far out, man, cool, you know. Everything's real hip. I remember going to see those movies and Shaft, yeah, um, Sweetback, something like we're gonna stick it to Whitey one more time <laughs> type thing, you know. <laughs>
Welcome to Wonderland. The Wonder Room is ready for you. Inside Wonderland are semi-permanent membrane organizers, needle fixative, log jams, and wonder clusters. Please come through the hole for candy. Inside Wonderland is lots of candy. You will get a prize of candy for coming inside Wonderland. For small children, we have here memory elixirs and toxins of time. For 11 to 14 year olds, manhandlers elevator fixers, and engorgement booths. Here in Wonderland, we have security equipment for children. Here in Wonderland, we have security toys and surveillance equipment for children. We have fortress booths and fortress construction kits here now. For a nice bag of candy, stand here now. Upon entering Wonderland, you will receive a bag of candy. Enter here for candy. To remove the bus driver from your school bus, please do the following. Pull at back of driver's neck with left hand, and then pull nose up with right. This should be distracting. Get a friend to sit on the lap of the driver. Scream. Scream again. Suck on the left eyeball of the driver. This should pull the eyeball out of the socket slightly. Then bite. There are cameras here for you in Wonderland. Come inside and play in Wonderland. There is free candy and video cameras. If you would like to talk about the restriction and restraint controls of your local playground, stand here now. For potions, elixirs, and rope control management, stand here 
now. For kid security equipment, stand here now. For learning how to outsource images from your house environment, stand here now. Thank you for coming to Wonderland. There are free microphones, candy, and cameras in Wonderland.
えますか Thank、you